you stood in front of a cute piece of art and took your little pictures, <clears throat> you would eat. Now do it before me. What's good y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Armani and you already read the title so you already know what your girl is doing today. I'm doing a sheen haul. It ain't no regular regular, regular sheen haul. It's a summer sheen haul. Cause where I'm at, it's already feeling like summer, okay? So me, I'm getting ready for summer. The pool about to open up in about two more weeks. Hot girl all summer. And to be a hot girl all summer, we need to get the right clothes. So I went on my favorite website, Shein, and I picked out some cute little pieces. So if you guys would like to see all the pieces that I picked in this haul, make sure you keep watching. And before we start this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I'm not forcing you or anything. Nah, but I really appreciate it if you like, comment, subscribe. And without further ado, let's get into the video. First, we're gonna start with accessories, bags, rings, necklaces, watches, all that stuff. The first thing I wanna show y'all is these cute, <laughs> these cute little purses I got. They're a dupe of the Jaquemus bags. I really, really do like these. The accent color on this one is silver. It comes with a strap inside here, but mine is already on because I kinda tie it like a belt. And I got these in two other different colors, white and black, and then I got one in yellow. Why I had to get the yellow one, I don't know, because I actually do not know what the word is with, but it's good to have you a little pop of color. This one comes with a strap too. They all come with straps, so you can wear them as a shoulder bag or a crossover bag, or you can even tie them like a belt. I think they're cute. I think it's very, very cute. These two have gold accents. I think that's really cute. And this white one has uh, silver. I don't know why I like that. It's giving details so you can match your jewelry with your bags. Like, you really gotta pay attention. But yeah, these are the three little bags that I got. I think they're very, very cute for summer just so you can put like your lip gloss or your mask in here. If you know you're not gonna go like anywhere serious now. Your phone is not gonna fit in here unless you got an iPod or something. So don't even think that's gonna happen with this bag. And next I have this cute little knot white bag well, i just thought this was real cute boo it's definitely giving island it's definitely giving you on a strip at myrtle beach right you on a strip and you're like oh yeah i don't want to bring nothing i don't want to bring a big purse because you know it's gonna be hot you're gonna be walking and you can put little stuff in here mine is flat right now because i haven't worn it but this is how it looks this is the back plain and it comes with a strap on the inside. You could wear it crossbody over the shoulder or you could just hold it with your hand. I like bags that have multiple choice answers because I don't wanna be stuck with a bag that I can only wear, like that I can only hold in my hand because sometimes that's very inconvenient. This bag comes with a strap. And I can say most of Sheen bags, if they're not already a shoulder bag, they come with a strap inside. Every bag that I've got from Sheen, except for this next bag coming up. So this next bag that I have, huh, Hold on, because I got to back up to show y'all this one. Don't look at my microphone. Do y'all see? This is definitely giving vacation. You have to get this if you're going on vacation. If you're going on vacation, you got to get a straw bag. Period. Like, you have to have a straw bag. Straw bags go with everything. So, it comes with these brown handles. I just don't know what it is about straw bags, but I love them. You can use this as a beach bag. This is a very cute beach bag. Put your sunglasses in here. Put maybe, not a whole towel, because this ain't big enough to hold a whole towel, but maybe like a couple rags or something just to, you know, be cute, dab off your face or whatever. You could throw your cover-up pants in here or your cover-up skirt, uh, kimono, however you say it. You could throw that in here too. Next, for accessories, I have these two on my wrist. And between you and me, this was too big for my wrist, right? So I had to put some rubber bands on here. To keep it on my wrist but we're not gonna talk about that just just look at what it's supposed to give this is the watch they do not come together i got both of these separately it was too big for my wrist but i actually like it i feel like it looks like the um jbw watches that all the girlies be getting i'm gonna give you one of them watches but for right now i'm gonna get this one from shane okay and it's giving what it's supposed to be giving and this little silver bracelet that i got separately I like this one because it gives like a minimalistic jewelry look. You ain't got to do too much, but you really just did everything you needed to do with it on. And I don't really have a lot of silver jewelry, 
but I feel like these two pieces really made it look like I really had a lot of silver jewelry. I got this ring off of Shane too, and I feel like this adds a little minimalistic accessory jewelry detail as well. Next, I got these rings. These are some very cute rings. Like they literally go with everything. These are actually two put in one, so I got um, another set of rings separately. I got a whole set of these in different colors, and then I got a whole set of these rings in different colors. I just put all of them in here. I just like these rings because they add like a pop of color to every outfit. Like if you have an all black outfit, knowing me, I love my black. I'm like, dang, I need some color. I need some color because my shoes have color, but I don't have anything else to match that color. But with these rings, like the colors and the accessories, okay? Sometimes gold and silver don't always hit with your outfit, especially like your rings that you have on. But when you have some colorful rings like this, they fit. They fit. They just do everything that it needs to do. These colors for summer, immaculate. I feel like if you, you could have these on in a picture by the pool and show like the details or whatever. Y'all, I'm giving y'all my ideas before I even do it. Now that I'm done with accessories, I'm gonna move on to tops. The first top I have is this beautiful green top that I wore in my last try on haul and I forgot to show it to y'all. So I'm showing it to you now. And this is most definitely a summer top. I love this top. It's a deep v-neck in the front. It's show a little cleavage, cleavage for the girls. And it's open in the back. You tie it around you. You'll see in the try on portion. But yes, I just love this color. I don't really wear a lot of color, but I feel like this summer, we need to step out the closet, okay? We need to get out here. We need to stop wearing black all summer being musty, okay? Cause no, who wears all black in the summer? No. For the next top, I have this cute little princess Tiana. This will forever be princess Tiana to me. Even though she wore green, I'm gonna wear pink. Like when I wear this shirt, I feel like Princess Tiana and it is what it is, but it's ruched in the front and it has these gold accents on the front right here. You can either put it on like a regular shirt or you can put it on like a jacket and then buckle it in the front. I ain't doing that because I'm gifted. So it's a little see-through, but when you're wearing it off, when you're looking at it, it's a little see-through, but um, when you put it on, it's not see-through at all. I say I got this shirt more for spring than summer, but color is color, okay? That's the new goal for this season, okay? We're gonna get some color in our closets. Yeah, I really like this top a lot. I don't really wear girly stuff like that, but I feel like I should step out of my comfort zone. So next, I got this mesh blue top. And when I bought this, I didn't think it was gonna be mesh. I don't know what went through my head that told me it wasn't going to be mesh, but um, I was very surprised when I got it. So it's this sheer blue top. I like this top, but the only thing I don't like about it is that it doesn't have adjustable strings. The straps are not adjustable at all, so it's not going to hold you up in the right places at all. But it's a nice little blue marble color. I really do like the purples and blues in this shirt. I feel like it really does bring out my skin tone. I feel like this is real cute for the summer. And yeah. Next, I have this white ribbed material crop top, tie front crop top. We love a little tie front crop top because it holds you in the front, girl. I feel like this is really cute for summer too. You could definitely wear this crop top with some shorts or mm, the foam runners. Or you can wear some dunks, some cute little dunks. The orange and white dunks. Uh, Throw on some blue shorts, uh, orange Yankee hat, and I also got it in a different color. Yeah, I really stepped out the box. I really stepped out my comfort zone with this one because it's rainbow. Girl, I don't do rain. I don't even do colors, and it's cute. I wore this one time before with my afro, and it was definitely given. It was definitely given Foxy Brown. Like I don't know who I thought I was. This is nice for. LA weather time. And if y'all don't know what I mean by LA weather, I haven't been to LA, but I know that it's blazing out there and I ain't talking Nicki Minaj and Kanye. Yeah, this is a cute little top to wear in hot weather. This shirt is rib material as well. You could tie it in the front as well. You'll see in the try on portion. Next, I have this basic top, this basic neon orange top. You know, it's really not nothing. <laughs> 
ain't nothing basic about this top i feel like this was very cute when i picked it up at first i looked at the front and i was like okay but when i saw the back it has these it's an open back and it has these buckles on it this is a good pop of color too and i don't really wear neon colors but i would say this orange is a really cute color next top i have is not really like a top i was gonna wear it as a cover-up but it is this white blouse it's sheer it's very light so yeah that's why i said i would wear it as a more of a cover-up than an actual shirt or i could pull one of those tight in the front pull up the sleeves type looks you might see it on the try on portion i don't know but um like i said it's see-through a little bit but i wasn't planning on wearing it as a real shirt anyway i was gonna wear it as a cover-up so if you buy this i would recommend wearing it more as a cover-up than a shirt but i would say this is perfect for if you just want to throw on a bikini but you don't really want your booty cheese out like that like i know when i wear a bikini i don't really want my whole body out there unless i'm finna be in the water but if i'm just gonna be like on the beach I want to have a cover up on so next i'm going to move on to dresses that i have this is the first dress that i got it's this roman aztec dress there was a point in time where these was all trendy and stuff like that and uh i'm still gonna make it pop out for the summer i don't care it's cute you can um draw string it up so you can show a little bit more leg and um these straps on this dress are adjustable, which I love because it holds you up. Like this dress really does snatch you in the right places and it holds you up where you wanna be held up. You know what I'm saying? Just makes everything tight and right, okay? And that's what we want. Now, I don't know about these booty cheeks on this dress. Now, I done seen like 10 booty cheeks so far. I feel like when you had this on, like you just like art. You just look like art when you have this on and you need to get this dress. You know what would be cute? If you wore this dress to like one of those Cause I be seeing the girls go to like museums and stuff and they will be taking like pictures in the museum. But what if you wore this Aztec art, Roman art, Greek art dress to a museum and you stood in front of a cute piece of art and took your little pictures, <clears throat> you would eat. Now do it before me, do it before I do it. Cause I'm telling you, if I do it, I'm gonna take my credit for it. Get this dress and do it before me and I'll let you have a credit. Next dress I have is this <clears throat> Aylingya, Aylingya. Black China was China Poom Poom. That's what we gonna call this dress. This dress is so freaking pretty. This is probably one of my favorite dresses that I ever purchased from Sheen. On me, it's very, very long. Like it kind of drags the floor. It kind of scrolls around because um, I'm 4'9". When I get maxi dresses, I know that they're gonna drag on the ground. These have adjustable straps too, which I really, really love. I love when things have adjustable straps, okay? Cause not everybody's shoulders is the same. Okay, not everybody boobs is the same. Not everybody testicles is the same. You going on vacation and you put on this dress and you want to strip. Or barefooted on the beach, boom. Curly hair, boom. It ain't, it ain't. Everybody will be turning heads when you walk by because this is a nice red. Like this ain't no plain, you know, dulled down, muted red. This is a bright, bright red. So next dress I have is this beautiful, I don't even know if you want to call this olive green, but this dress is beautiful. Like, I used to hate green on me. Like I said, I don't know what possessed me to get any of this stuff in my cart because I don't wear color. But all of these pieces, all of these pieces are cute. It's kind of short, kind of raunch. It has an open back. You could tie it around the back so you can adjust it however you want. I seen Dierra wear this dress with her um, straw bag. So, you know what? I had to zoo. We love Diera over here. If you haven't watched my Diera makeup tutorial, you need to go watch that. That just shows that I love Diera. Yeah, I seen her wear this dress on her vacation. I was like, this would be cute on my vacation. A vacation that I don't know when I'm going on, but we're gonna manifest it. So last but not least, I have some shoes. These shoes, y'all. Not me about to drop the box. These heels are so cute. But let me turn around. Let me turn around to the bag. Let me turn around to the bag. Like, who do you know? Who do you know? No, I'm not going to lie. I saw Diera had some heels kind of like this, but she was walking on Christmas ornaments. So I tried to find something like that. And I'm not walking on Christmas ornaments, but I'm walking on shapes. And we love it here. These are very comfortable too. And that's coming from somebody who doesn't even wear heels. The heel is not that high, obviously, you can tell. And the straps are not... Damn, I just smacked myself in the face with a shoe strap. Wow. 
and the straps are not tight around your ankle or anything like that. I wear a size five in women, four in boys, so I got these in a size 36. I feel like that was important to say. So yeah, if you wear a five in women or a 5.5 in women, cause sometimes I risk it and get a 5.5 and it still feel good like in my regular shoes. If you wear a five or a five and a half or a four in boys, then get a 36. I think that's everything I have for this haul, you guys. That's everything. It was a short little haul. I know, I know. But I will have more hauls coming soon. I hope you guys like these pieces that I showed you. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned for more. Another haul coming soon your way. Another haul is coming soon. Okay. And I will see you guys in the next video.